Go ahead. Okay. The character's name is Destiny. She's 23. She lives in Fiji. And she lives in a large mansion that is very clean. She's a psychic. Uh, she, she makes appointments for her job. It's 30 minutes. Uh, every 30 minutes is $30. The character lives with a ghost. She talks to the ghost for fun and it teaches her about life. She's gloomy and depressed and she doesn't lose her temper. She's scared that the ghost will control her. Her favorite place is a little pond by uh, an old tree. She really has no secrets and she carries a satchel full of ghost books. Um, the time period is 2011. She has long red hair with small ears and a small nose, green eyes, and she's light skinned. She has the birthmark of a heart on her arm. She has an American accent. She dresses in red or black or rock band t-shirts. She's mentally strong. Her weaknesses are the love. She wants to be normal. She's afraid of control from the ghost. She has no friends and nothing big really happens. Um, the conflict is that the ghost will get overpower from her and she has to stop the ghost. And, the, and she interacts with the clients that she helps and a guy likes her who is one of the clients. And um, she will learn that nobody can be normal. Mark is a client that falls in love with Destiny. She thinks he's a really good guy. He's a tall man with jet black hair and freckles and a small nose. Uh, he's a very passionate guy who doesn't spend that much time with people. Desiree is a client that meets with Destiny and wants to be friends with her. And Des Desiree has wavy hair, hazel eyes, and she's half white half black and she's very curvy and fun and energetic. Alright, go. Oh, oh, hey, so What's up, SB? <laughs> right. Man, how you been like, man? Man, I've been cool, but I almost got hit by this taxi car. For real? Brooklyn dangerous nowadays. Uh, I, I hear you, man. Well, like, what happened? Where were you going? So I was walking on 42nd and 3rd Street, mm -hmm. and I promised right past the library this speeding taxi. Just crazy, man. I don't know what to say. Mm -hmm. That's because you know, never really seen a speeding taxi before. Well, you actually really pay attention to that. Pay attention to what? The what? taxi. I didn't. That, I don't understand what that was, but okay. Sounds like it's pretty good, you know, working on my ball game. Who are you playing against? Uh, playing against Highlands of Lake. How are we gonna win that game? Yeah. Starting receiver right here. You know, I've been you know, attention to the school stats, you know, they've been three and you know, undefeated so far. You know, we're pretty good right now. So, so how about homecoming? What? Who are you going with? Oh I, never mind, never mind. You know, going with that one girl Vanessa. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. I haven't found anybody so far, but you know, once find that person. You know, you get the words coming out, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, well, I'll, I'll see you. I'll see you later. Okay, you're right. All right. Um, my name is Vanessa. I'm 16 years old. I live in New Haven. Um, I live. I come from a wealthy family. Um, I live with my parents. Um, in a uh, like I live in. I live with my parents in a beautiful house. And I have a boyfriend named George. I really love him, and I wish we could have a healthier relationship. But I feel like he has insecurities. He sometimes feels shy, and I sometimes don't really blame him because I feel like I'm from a wealthy family, and he's like the opposite of me. He's not from a well-class family, so I think that. Sometimes it is the reason why he is that way 
and he is a footballer. He needs a scholarship to get into college and I don't need a scholarship, I can get to college easily because my parents can pay and I wish that I could be with him like all the time but I feel like he's changing. I don't know what's wrong, I've been talking to him all the time but I've been talking to him all the time and he didn't he hasn't really given me a specific answer but I am going to try because I want to keep him and I want all of us to graduate and go to college and be happy. I like to watch movies, play around, read some books. I'm kind of quiet, but um, I can be kind of noisy and annoying sometimes. And I love being with George, playing with him and making kind of fun of him. And I like being reading and being in the library. And I'm, I'm a cheerleader, so I like looking at cheerleaders. And I like, I'm a cheerleader, so I get to go to every football game to see my boyfriend play. the biggest like pep rally oh my gosh i'm so tired I, i'm still doing like the chilling woo let's go rounds so how was the game it was okay i mean like you know it could have been i did better. not see you make any passes and i was like cheering and i was like go taylor woo you always see my arm it's not what it used to be you know it's getting then why don't up. you exercise like all well, the weights it just messes up you know i've been tearing this stuff right here. I'm sorry, but they did their best, like, job, yay, but, yeah, so, how's, how's, like, still going? It's cool, I mean, you know, chemistry, that project is really getting to me. Seriously? Um, how about you? That's good, I'm in physics, so, stuff is hard, 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 it's like a physics crazy. Must be but, yup, so, yeah, I think I'm about to go, if you're not talking about anything, you know, find me out with you. Whatever. Um, my name is Anna, and I live in like a me medium house, and um, I have one brother, but he's younger than me, so he's annoying. And I have mom, and dad, of course, so I have both parents in the house. And um, my boyfriend is um, my boyfriend is uh. How do I, I just forget his name, I'm just joking. I just like to call him my boyfriend and my boo thing. So yeah, I don't call him by his first name. And also, I'm a cheerleader if I haven't said that already. And cheerleading is not just about like doing this. And it's, it's a lot of work and you have to go to every game and participate. And some days you don't want to smile, but you have to smile. And, um, and what I really hope for this year is for me and my boyfriend relationship to last. Because my grades are good. I get like all A's and B's and school is really easy to me. So I just want me and my wife to have a happy relationship throughout the whole year. Yeah. Hi, my name is Disarray. I'm a vampire. I've been alive since 1895. Yes. I don't like you. Go away. What? I don't. What did I what did I do to not be liked? I was born. Well, jeez, that's not that's not very cool. Yeah, go away. Well I I was here first though. I was My name? I'm Mark. That I did. Um, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm telling you. You're not. I'm saying. I'm sorry. No. Hold on. I call my friend. Hold on. Hello? I do not like people, I do not like to be bothered, and if I am, kill you. Don't. I'm a friend. Hello. Hello! Hey, how's it going? The sky is very blue today. Yes. There's not a cloud in the sky. It's 
nice day. But that's not good. Why? Why is it not good? I didn't like the song. Why not? I'm allergic. You're allergic to the song? That doesn't make very much sense. It does. You see how pale I am? Not really. <laughs> Who you like? Person. You don't like tea and crumpets. Conference. Yes, they are very good in Where are you from? London? No! That was sarcasm. Oh. oh. I can't really tell. Sarcasm. Because you're stupid! Well, calm down. But it's okay yeah. because I'm a singer. I'm gonna sing a song. No! Pitiful! Terrible! I am Simon! No! Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.